The Nigerian Air Force says that no amount of welfare and compensation is sufficient to reward veterans and fallen heroes of the Nigerian Armed Forces for their selfless service defending the nation's sovereignty and territory against enemy. The Air Force Commanding Air Training Command Kaduna Air Vice Marshal Namdi Ananaba stated these at a seminar and workshop organized for veterans of the Nigerian Air Force as part of the 2024 Armed Forces Remembrance Day celebration across the country. A two-day retreat and seminar for retirees of the Nigerian Air Force seminar focused on navigating life after retirement, shedding light on the prospects and challenges that veterans may encounter in their post-military journey into civil society. The Air Officer Commanding Air Training Command, Air Vice Marshal Nam Dianana says the event is to honor veterans for their commitment and dedicated service to the nation by ensuring that the labor of our heroes past would not be in vain. He added that the retirees should be to see beyond retirement by being employers of labor rather than seeking a job. One thing that remains clear is the fact that no amount of compensation can adequately reward our veterans for their service. Some paid the supreme sacrifice in their service to the nation, while others completed their service, retired, and are able to be here with us today. Whether dead or living, we always reflect on the many sacrifices and tell the stories of their exploits while in service. One can retire to become a job creator and not a job seeker. One must determine to overcome the challenges of post-service life and embrace the prospects of retirement. Some of the veterans expressed their gratitude and shared their experiences on life after retirement, which has given them freedom. This is the first of its kind. Since I personally entered the Nigerian Air Force, it has never been done to the retirees. That is. So life after retirement, honestly, is a peaceful life stage. And we appreciate the NAV authority and we thank Almighty God for giving us the opportunity to witness it. Honestly, I'm really enjoying my life after retirement, the freedom of speech, freedom of movement and all whatnot. So life after retirement was, in fact, it's more beautiful than the service itself when I was in service. I travel anywhere to see my grandchildren, to see my children outside the country without pass. Our services are ready at any given time, long as we are breathing, alive and strong, to serve this nation. We are instructors to most of them. We train them and we still have some vast experience which they brought us back to spray it and bring up. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.